So we are hopefully live. Let me double. Yep, we are live. So now that the volume has been checked and everything is running good, I want to start making sure I double check my audio so that way I don't have quiet streams um, anymore. <laughs> So, hello everybody and welcome back to Catherine Full Body. This is the, um, I guess the remastered edition, more or less, of the original Catherine game. Um, I do have technically the first portion of Night One done on a previous um, video, if you did want to see that. Um, oh, they swap positions. Interesting. Enjoy the story by taking control of our tormented main character and guiding him to freedom. So, on the last game we played through the initial... Enjoy the story by taking control of our tormented yes. main character and guiding him to freedom. We are aware. We went through the first night... So I believe we should be either ending the first night or starting the second night now. Continue so we are going to continue the story. Okay, so it is the second night and we are in the prison of despair. Um, and this is where, you know, we start kind of figuring out what's going on and um, kind of seeing the reaction of uh, Vincent versus what's what's going on here. Maybe this will be useful. I'll have to we're discussing techniques. The the kid We're discussing techniques. The I think we already talked to all the sheets that we can talk to. We were getting ready to move on. So, if I am not mistaken, anyway, so we learned from these two sheep on the last time, uh, one was saying like pull one block out, um, go up, pull a second block out, and then pull it over, and then continue doing that, um, so that way you've kind of got like a zigzaggy um, staircase. The other one had the pyramid idea, which was like if you need to go up four steps, so you pull out three, and then you go up, and then you pull out two, and then you go up, and then you pull out one, and then from there you can hop on the board. Step. Um, so those were the steps that we learned. So now we get to answer the fun question. Or rather, nice to see you here, and welcome to the confessional. Who are you? Oh, yes, the confessional. This is the world of nightmares. I guess you could call me its supervisor. I sense a force of change rising up. What exactly happened in the other world? I guess it doesn't matter. You lambs are all destined to die here anyway. What? Not if I can help Ridiculous. it. Ridiculous. But before I kill you, I want to determine the value of your life. So you'll have to answer some questions. Question one. What expectations do you have for your significant other? Pull the rope with the answer that best matches your true feelings. <laughs> Expectations for my significant other. Good looks or good personality? I personally go with good personality. Oh, so that's your choice. Because looks come and go. Different. Hey, who are you? Are you doing all this? I told you. I'm just the supervisor. I'm just the someone supervisor. Else you here. It's someone you know. <sighs> You never know what people are actually thinking. To learn the truth, you must survive. 
Then you can think about what's going on here. Let's head to the next trial. His position in this game, uh, the move supervisor guy, kind of reminds me of work. Or just kind of one of those. I just work here. I don't. I don't set prices for stuff. <laughs> So at least on the first time players who have um, been online, it looks like almost 75, a little under 75% have said that they prefer personality over looks. Revolts, results from people in their 20s and 30s from just the men for just the women so wait how big of a difference is that huh it's not that far off but there's there's still a significant chunk so this is the women and this is the men the men's little slice of pink is just a hair bigger but it's still pretty neck and neck other players first time data okay so it's just the just the three <laughs> there's still more commencing area two are you ready are you ready uh no all right i got it <laughs> Sorry, Oop. man, but I'm not going to die helping you. I've got to climb, too. Oh, yeah. As you climb, you'll run into strange items. Strange items? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'll try to remember it for later. You can only carry one item at a time, but each one has a very useful purpose. Don't worry about using an item at the wrong time. If you regret it, you can always undo. Undo. When you use a white block, a 3x3 platform will appear at your feet. This enables you to create footing even in tight spaces. Oh, okay. So we've got a little platform that we can create to help us get us far in the game. Right, I got it. Time to Dude, move. This one's a bit trickier. I don't remember how to solve this. Sorry. 
Undo. Shoot. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to pull that one. It's too close. All right. <laughs> if you use retry assist, you'll automatically climb back to where you left off. The setting to turn retry. No. All right, I got it. You don't need the retry assist. Got it. Reach on over, up to the step. Watch out for this dude to get a seat. That is going to be the way. A different approach then. Alright, so we are going to try going up this way. And try a new strategy. Go up this way. Pull out this. Drop. on the right path. 
to retry that whole thing all on, over again. This time I kind of know what I'm doing, so we'll hopefully go back a little faster. Alright, so Excuse me, sheep. Excuse me, sheep. Get that, get that. Pull this out. Oh, no. Alright, I got it. Alrighty. So I think it's something to do with this. Edge. Undo. Undo. And Be one of these. Remember, you can always go back and undo some of your moves. Stay calm and keep climbing. Yeah, I'm trying to stay calm. I just can't. What the hell is okay. this place? How high does this damn thing go? <laughs> I don't know. I wish I did. I don't know. I wish I did. Well, apparently you're here in the now-ish time too, so... Can't have, uh, been too far off, I guess. Alright, I got it. Sorry guys, I got like too quiet and too close to go. This could be so tough. It was getting very difficult there. <laughs> so this is why I love puzzling games, but I get a little on the quiet side when I play puzzle games. Look how they've got like the fancy carpet and all that it's you. out. Looks like you're still alive. <laughs> Is For it now? You? You're safe too. Barely. Still. How many people died trying to come here? People. I don't. Listen. Here, you see everybody else as sheep, but all these sheep, they're really human. There's got to be some reason why we were all brought here. What reason could there be? Why do we have to suffer like this? Who <laughs> knows? Because. But I do have an idea. An idea? Let's stop the speculation. It's just going to confuse us more. <sighs> you should think of what to do next. I'm hearing rumors of something big coming soon. You be careful now. Something big? Still, you're really <laughs> getting the hang of things. There's nothing more I can teach you. That can't be true. Come on, you gotta have something you can tell me. If we're lucky, we'll meet again. 
Hey, wait! Great. All right. You could learn tips on how to climb. Moving blocks around mindlessly won't work. Try to pick up some useful techniques here. Yeah, I've tried. New techniques tried. will be written down by the other sheep. I found this out just now. Yo, have we met before? You survived because of the techniques I found, huh? Tell me yes, so teach me something more. Allow me to explain suspending. This technique gives you more room to maneuver. Push a block off a ledge with nothing below it. As long as the edges connect, the block will remain in place. Yeah, I know that. I'm a regular blockologist. Huh? Blockologist. <laughs> hmm, that's a good sign. Try to remember this one too. Allow me to explain pullback. Oh, this is the one that I was doing earlier. If you climb up and find yourself stuck, try pulling a block and backing down. By creating a stairway as you go down, you will be able to go higher than you could before. Yeah, it was the crazy. technique you that I was using a little bit earlier. Um, well. Okay, if you find any new moves, you come straight to me. This is coming from the executive manager. I'll write down any techniques I discover. I recommend reading them from time to time. Cool. We've got a few more techniques to actually add to our arsenal. We use stop with the yelling. It's fuzzy and fluffy at the same time. And it's coming right at me. Snap out of it. There's nothing like that anywhere near here. <laughs> I saw a sheep fall past me on my way up. I, I can't get that scream out of my head. It won't go away. Oh, you're here. Death scream. You can stay here. Even this place will fall eventually. What's with all the cubes? I don't understand any of this. What should I do? Please help me. Just gotta climb. Learn some techniques to get higher. Techniques? <laughs> like what? Oh, come on, teach me. Anything. Maybe this will Allow me to explain the tornado. If blocks are stacked all over the place, calm down and pull them out one by one. Oh, I see. Move them aside. Like little and zigzag. Bring them down like a tornado. Make a staircase and climb. Somehow I feel like we're gonna have to use all of those techniques on um, like one of the next night or two. Wow, you're amazing. Oh, I think I can go on a little longer. I'm thinking about that technique you showed me, so I won't forget. I think the technique went like allow me to explain oh. if blocks are stacked. Sorry, I move them aside didn't mean to click on that. Then make a staircase. I think I'm gonna keep going. I'm thinking about Sorry, I gotta go. Good luck. Alright, so we talked to that sheep. Let's talk to the sheep. Sheep with a scarf. No, nothing. Let's make it out alive. I'm not sure how I feel about being encouraged by a sheep. But I guess it's better than being a chef. Or even worse, a kitchen hand. Huh? What's a kitchen band? I said hand, you idiots! Kitchen hand, like a cook. Pay attention. Uh. <sighs> Kitchen band. Kitchen band. That would be uh, Sorry for interesting. Shouting, you need to listen better. There's nothing. Wow, oh, you're new here. Am I right? Let me ask. Do you have any coins? You may have seen them lying around while you're climbing. I'll trade you useful items for them. Would you rather have coins than an item? I'm a numismatist. I love money. There's nothing <laughs> in life money can't buy. I've got a plaque with that on it in my office. 
No matter what world you're in, as long as you've got money, you can do anything. These gold coins are symbols, symbolizing money. And if that's the case, then I can save myself if I have enough of it. That's my theory. Oh, so you don't know... If you are still having trouble getting through a stage, you can buy items with coins. If you are already carrying an yeah. item, it will be replaced if you buy a new one. However, buying items makes it more difficult to earn the gold prize. Interesting. Item, only have some coin. Tonight's product is... The white cube creates a platform of blocks at your feet. Which we already have one of those, so we definitely don't need to get that. Excuse me. Please come. You're not very good on the customer service side, are you? Are you the same as me? Were you put down here by some trick? Why were we chosen? Do you know anything? Come on. How can I survive? I can't keep climbing. I don't know anything either. Listen. You want to live and climb. That's all you can do. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yep. How would the world not notice that people were dying of, like, mysterious causes like this? Like, that just... I'm sure someone will probably put two and two together. Eventually. You're just some sheep! I'll show you next time! Hey, I heard that all the sheep here are actually people. Newsflash! Fuck you! I need to make sure you. <laughs> That's not right. No. Does that a matter of right or wrong? It's about right and yeah. What good is having pity going to do you in here? Well, I don't want to get shoved off any more than any that other sheep. I only. I'm gonna. I only show the sheep that I absolutely have to, and there's only like two or three that you kind of have to in the game. Um, otherwise, they will bop you off stuff. themselves. Next question: What do you value? I've had enough of this. A man's worth can't be measured by a single question. Not to mention, you have more than one path ahead of you. <laughs> this is the second question. Does life begin or end with marriage? <sighs> that's the the winning question right there. <laughs> so that's your answer. I see. This is actually a giant chapel with eight floors. Wait, eight floors. Does that mean there's an end to this? The world is in a state of flux. I won't be able to guarantee what your future holds. Be careful what you take for granted. I'm sure you've heard the stories of people losing such things. Something big is coming. I can feel it. Something the likes of which this world has never seen. <sighs> I guess there's no point in worrying about the future. You have more pressing matters to attend to. <laughs> eight nights, eight like the, or eight uh, floors of the hell's going on here? doing these. Well, I should have saved before we went into the chapel, or into the little confessional. That's okay, that just means we gotta do one more. One more round at least. Alright, so for the question, does life begin or end with marriage? It looks like... About two thirds of the population for the first time data said it begins. For men, it looks like probably about, say, somewhere around like 85 ish percent say it begins. Oh wow. So, this is the men. And this is the women. There's more women who say that it ends, um, at least from their 20s and 30s, um, overall. Yikes. That's kind of an interesting, uh, thought there. Alright. You so, won't escape. Huh? 
Ooh. You get those things. I won't What the hell is this? Catherine? The fists of grudge have appeared. It's the killer. Do not die. It's a killer. Do not die. In other words, climb quickly because. When you use a bell, all nearby blocks will be converted into normal white blocks. Okay. The so bell that includes or that makes all the regular blocks this into is white handy blocks. For getting rid of tricky obstacles such as cracked blocks or immovable blocks. Yes, it does. Edge. Oh, jeez, that laugh. She's gone a little bit psychotic. Catherine, I think you need to take a chill pill, honey. that pyramid move where I need to get up three steps so I can remove the bottom um, two first. Do that backwards move. Don't you make a fool of me? Undo, undo, undo. Actually, I need this way, don't I? If you're stuck, it may be best to try and undo it. I got it. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're gonna get a chest point. Grab this one. Go up. Fork! Don't use the forks. Edge. Bad for you. Stab me with a fork? How rude. Don't you run? That was like Is it gone? I'm safe, <laughs> right? Yeah! For now. <laughs> Remember, there's eight floors. He just told you that there was eight floors to this thing. And you've gone up, what, maybe two? Congratulations. You have escaped from the prison of despair. And we get a promise. I have something special to show you tonight. Think back to long ago. Back to a time when you felt happy. Happy? Um, five Sorry years ago. Today. I don't usually burn the bacon like that. It's all right. I don't mind it a little crispy. I can tell something's going on with you. You working too hard? <laughs> no, I'm fine. You've been gaining weight, haven't you? Can't forget to eat your veggies. Well, I put ketchup on almost everything. <laughs> that doesn't count. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> hey, 
Hey. <laughs> Maybe a little workout will burn out those extra calories. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a cute little cutaway. <laughs> what do you think? Fond memories, huh? You should think yeah, long and hard about what you have to lose. Let's do this again tomorrow. If you can survive, that is. Damn the eyes. Ooh, those eyes. Oh, they give me every, every skinny time. Dirty little apartments. With Catherine. Yeah, I forgot that you had a bunch of things. Marriage there. is just a tradition, right? Seriously, who wants to be tied down? As long as two people are together, it's okay, right? It's best to be free, don't you think? Kind of surprising. Hmm? You know how it is with most girls. As soon as they're adults, all they can think about is tying the knot, right? Uh. But there are girls like you out there. <laughs> Never knew. Oh, it's not that strange, is it? Men aren't the only ones who fear being chained down. I'll remember that. Because it depends on what your version of marriage is. If it's Thank a goodness. ball and huh? chain or like... if it's oh. freeing. <laughs> you moved <laughs> way too quickly from my liking. You just it got instant blush drunk. <laughs> <laughs> what is uh, it? Uh, uh, what is it? <laughs> Whoa! You you alright? Yeah, thank you. You're so kind. <laughs> uh I was uh, sorry. Uh, uh, uh well, I uh, have to work tomorrow, so I need to get home. Whoa. Mm -hmm. I had fun tonight. Oh, oh. <laughs> you must like what you see. <laughs> I'm not staring. You're a bad liar. I'm not staring at that. <laughs> <laughs> Cute girl comes up to you and starts hitting on you. I mean, it's a little obvious. You taste like smoke, <laughs> but I don't mind. Ha! <laughs> you don't say. <sighs> animation on these little cutscenes though is so fantastic holy shit oh man this is not good <laughs> what is it good well uh you know hooking up after we just met jeez what the hell am i saying hmm. huh? um is this gonna be a problem so uh just a bit cheated on Catherine. This is bad, really bad. But I didn't make a move. <laughs> she forced herself on me. Oh, fuck, man. I drank way you too much. You took her home uh, and slept with her. So. Uh, would you mind not staring at me like that? It's kind of creepy. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Listen, I don't want you to get the wrong idea, okay? I don't just sleep around. I came here because I like you. Huh? No. No. So. Yeah, now you're in a pickle. Do you Which Catherine me? do you want? Huh? Oh. Wow. Um. I can't quite explain it. Uh. I feel odd. Hmm? Huh? You see, this is my first time. Oh, wow. I can't believe it. And I am really screwing this up right now. <laughs> so then, it was love at first sight? Huh? <laughs> what? I'm sorry. I'm really... You said you have to work, right? Work? Uh, I guess... Sorry! I, uh, I gotta go now! I have a, <laughs> a dentist appointment now! Dentist? Yeah! The dentist will be angry if you're late, too. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to stay with you a little longer. 
The fact that she gets all flustered and worried about him. Hey, wait. Without I'm even like thinking to ask if he's so. like in a relationship. <sighs> this is a mistake. A mistake. It's gotta be a mistake. So kudos dude, you have like a full collection of uh, you know white what? boxes just with hit me. polka dot. You know how they say every guy has three hot streaks with the ladies in his life? This is your third. <laughs> That's putting hot mom. Streaks. Well, when the hell were the other two? When we were kids, you're the most popular with the girls. <laughs> I don't remember that. The second time you were in the zone was when you started dating Catherine. Although, uh, that's over if she finds out about this. <sighs> Crap, man. She's probably gonna kill me. That's what you're all scared about. As long as she doesn't find out, you're safe, right? Just act like it never happened. I'm not like you. I can't just ignore this. Well then, <clears throat> why not switch it up? That way you won't hear any more marriage talk, right? All that stuff about soulmates and eternal love is bullshit. Married life sucks, man. You really want to go through the same shit I have? I'm not oh, like pardon. you. I don't want to sleep around. I just want life to stay the same. <sighs> what am I gonna do? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. If you're gonna whine, you shouldn't have done it, dumbass. Well, no right? shit. I wish I could just live all carefree like you. Don't you realize there's nothing you can do, you schmuck? No matter how good you are to a woman, you never know if she'll stab you in the back. <sighs> well, if you're gonna ditch the new girl, hook me up. She's cute, right? You got a picture of her? Nice. No, I don't have her pic. She's not your type, anyway. Come on, how do you know that? Because she's my type. Oh. <laughs> I am so fucked. Hey, have you heard the rumor about the dream where you're falling? Huh? Who cares? Come on, if you fall and die in the dream, you'll die in real life. My friend's boyfriend almost died. Isn't that scary? Huh? How do you know? Were you able to see his dream? Hey, uh, you all right, man? Mm -hmm. You don't look so hot. Uh, I guess I didn't really get much sleep last night. Obviously. Anyway, you're way too freaked out <laughs> about a one night stand. Love how he's talking hey, about the nightmare that he's experiencing. Yep, the other guy was obviously jabbing at him for being with another gal. Huh. I never saw the girl. Oh, really? So I figured clock. one of you guys told her to sit with me. Uh, if this girl was cute, he'd definitely remember. You know, I gotta say. Because of you, jerks. I never get a chance to date anyone. If I was a ladies man, I wouldn't be here every night with you guys. Anyway, you dig the older chicks, don't you? Yeah, I want a woman who's, you know, mature, stern, has a nice pair of heels. Whoa, man. I like that creepy guy in horror movies who tries too hard to be noticed. <laughs> Shut up! I'm not like that! What's wrong with, you know, having some adult fun with someone older than I am? <laughs> so? Did I hear someone call for me? Oh, hey, Erica! I've got a nice pair of stiletto heels I know how to use. Whoa, Erica. <laughs> okay, enough of that. So have you guys heard about the woman's wrath? They woman's say wrath. it targets cheating men and kills them. Or not. Which is it? Wait, 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 what? What exactly is this woman's wrath? Oh, you don't need to worry about it. You only care about your girl, Vincent. Oh, what are you talking about? This guy totally needs to know. Cheating <laughs> is pathetic. I agree with Toby. Pathetic. What are you calling pathetic? Shut up and eat your peanuts. My eye... Huh? What? You're cheating. Weren't you talking about marriage? Why don't you say it louder? Seriously, stop yelling about cheating and shit. I think someone on Mars didn't quite hear you. Oh, that's low, Vincent. <laughs> Lowest of the low. Don't call me that. Now you know. Let's just leave me alone. Well, well, come on, tell me about this girl. Oh, God. A 
Apparently, she's destiny level cute. Fuck that shit. Level cute. <laughs> Are you kidding? Mm -hmm. Your soulmate is awesome. I'm totally jealous. You jackasses better not mention this to anyone outside the bar. I am serious. <laughs> Dude, we know the drill. Say, have you heard? It seems that Boss was a bit of a player back in the day and broke more than his share of hearts. You see how he's wearing those tacky sunglasses indoors? They say he's using those to hide his face. <laughs> yeah, right. You're in hot water yourself, mm. right? Maybe you should invest in some shades. Maybe you should invest in some shades. Ha, ha, ha. Shut up. I'm done fooling around. Oh, by the way, Rin's gonna play the piano here starting today. So she did get the job. Okay. So. Uh, hurry, get up! It's coming oh, okay. for me. So they're gonna. They're gonna show the cutscene. That. want to know what that is. Colors? I don't know if that's supposed to be a clue. Uh, you okay? Hello? Do you know where you are? Okay, never mind that. Uh, how about a name? Uh, uh, Rin. Rin? That's a nice name. Uh. Is that though? That's what we need to find out. Yeah. Oh. What was that? Amateur hour. Oh, don't say that. Rin's working really hard. Uh, Vincent? What did you think of my performance? Oh, it was, uh, great. Yeah, it was great. Really, uh, unique. Unique. Thank you so much. I was hoping to play a little better than that, but... Don't worry about it. No one gets things perfect the first time around. I guess yeah, you're right. You just gotta keep practicing. I'll have to keep practicing. <laughs> yeah, if the bar doesn't go out of business by then. God! <laughs> Well, I'll see you later. See you. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's perfect. Me and Toby. I mean, <laughs> if she's that cute, who cares, right? <laughs> mm, uh, what's up with you anyway? Saving some cute girl from a stalker in the streets? Sounds like a daytime soap opera. That stuff doesn't really happen. Well, it did, so give it a rest. Well, Does it did. Does girl really have amnesia? Erica, you took her to the doctor, right? Did they find anything? Not really. Find anything? Not really. They think it's only temporary. But it must be hard when the only thing Not exactly is how many is you know. or... Hey, so are you two really neighbors now? Yeah, the last guy just happened to move out. You better keep your hands off her. <laughs> oh, shut up. It's not like that. I, I'm an old man over here. <laughs> You guys really came through for us. You know it. Having Rin work here was a great idea, huh? We have you guys and even a police officer as customers. Not to mention, public spaces are a lot safer if she's really being stalked by someone. Yeah. True. Sorry, I don't want to interrupt any of the gameplay since a lot of this is actually new. That conversation didn't happen before. I think it was the... You can drink by pressing the square button. Or get up by pressing the circle button. Um, we'll continue this here in a second. Um, but that whole cutscene, for the majority of it, is actually brand new to me. Um, so Rin, little pink haired chick in the corner, not doing so hot on the piano tonight, is... A new character added to this updated version of the game, um, if anyone hadn't watched the previous playthrough of mine. 
to the whole little conversation about her and everything that's going on with her, all that is completely brand new to this version of the game. So, I know that... You can open menus with the options button. You can change the puzzle. Um... So I know that the that she's supposed to have some kind of effect in the dream world eventually, but I don't know exactly what effect it is that she ends up doing. So sorry about that guys, had to uh, grab a package for delivery. <laughs> Just got my groceries delivered in. Um, thankfully it's all my dry goods, so I don't have to worry about those quite yet. Um, but see, where, what was I saying? Um, Rin, pink hair girl, she's plays the piano and it's supposed to affect us throughout the night as the nights progress but I don't know if it's going to be on the classic mode which is what we are currently on we're playing the normal difficulty on classic I don't know if she affects the classic mode or if she's only affecting the remix mode we'll have to um pardon me um, see if she affects the classic mode. If not, then we will need to do a playthrough of the remix. So that way we can... Um... So that way we can see what's going on with her story and how she affects the play setting. Yeah, we're going to cancel out of that. So... Let's, I guess... Check our phone real quick. Oh, we received a few. Um... To all customers. When you spend time in Stray Sheep, you'll receive text messages on your phone. You can even reply to somebody. Yeah, we actually read that, didn't we? You can view your past experiences with the movie function. And from Midnight Venus, it says, Fantastic news, you, fantastic news. Congratulations, you have successfully completed Stage 1, the Underground Cemetery. Go to award from the cell phone menu to check the challenge or your best score. So this was the underground cemetery. You can't retry safety stages. When you play the game on safety difficulty, your score will be saved under easy. So we have played the normal mode. Maybe on a few of the, like, once we get a few nights in, we'll go back and revisit, like, the first stage and do the remix. Or, uh, try and see how high of a score we can get on the 
um, on these other ones. I don't want to bother with retrying right now. Um, so we've got the Prison of Despair here, and we have the bronze trophy on the normal mode because I could not figure that one out for a little bit. Um, oh, I guess. Oh, so those are the messages that we got earlier. So we've got movie. Oh, it's unfortunately not going to let me, I'm sorry about that guys. Um, it's not going to let me check out the movies and, uh, without canceling out of the screen. Um, apologies about that. Um, so then we've got the awards. There are the movies, but we can't really see those. And then the diary, which we can use to save and load. We're gonna just talk to we'll keep an eye on her. Talk what about to Johnny. You? Are you okay? That thing about men who cheat being cursed? Apparently it's related to those mysterious deaths. You mean like how Paul died? Yeah. Or it is, this is getting called the woman's wrath. <laughs> Sounds like something Erica would like to have. Hey, Paul's been here a few times, right? Yeah, he was a classmate of ours back in high school. I ran into okay. him just the other day. Seriously? How was he? We just traded greetings, but he looked fine. Maybe I should have paid more attention. Hey, it's not your fault. Interesting. Hmm? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Maybe if I talk to Paul more, this. You got a mail. You can take your phone out to check it by pressing the triangle button. You can also save images and. All right, so I do know that eventually we start getting a few um, kind of more risque um, things from uh, the girls later on, or at least. Blondie Catherine. I don't know about pink haired Rin, um, um, how her storyline goes. So, those ones might have to be not necessarily streamed. I know that it's fairly tame up until I want to say like the fifth or sixth night. Um, as far as I remember, but I don't know how things will go with the new girl, too. So, fantastic news, prison of despair, yeah, yeah, we, we already saw that. Thank you. If I took a shot right. every time she hit a wrong note, <laughs> that's a deal breaker oh. for me, no matter how cute she is. You and Kathy are here so rude. Time, right? What was it like in the beginning? I just want to know for reference. Yeah, it wasn't anything special, it was at the reunion. He was giving her dating advice. Then he ended up falling for her himself, right? <laughs> he ran to her side in the middle of the night when she was depressed, after all. Hey, stop that. Stand-up guy like that turns out to be a cheater. <laughs> Seriously. Hmm. Somehow I'm thinking that... Uh... You're actually really sensitive, aren't you? You don't look it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shut up. Running to the side of someone who is... You got him Maybe out. a little out of sorts with the mind might have uh, led him to feel obligated to possibly try to make her feel better. Okay, so from Catherine, are you at SS again? Are you all drinking again? I stopped by your apartment today, but you weren't there. I wanted to talk to you about something, but I guess it'll have to wait until tomorrow. By the way, your place is filthy. I told you you had to empty the trash more often. I took it out this time, but you need to be more okay. Careful, okay? That's all. Good night. Uh, sorry I wasn't home. What did you want to talk about? Want to talk now? We'll, we'll play kind of nice cards with, um, Catherine. Alright, talk to Orlando real uh, quick. You filed a police report, yeah? Guess we'll hear something sooner or later. Worst case, we'll just let her stick around here. 
Don't even think about making a move on her, all right? Ha, you're one to talk. You got your own shit to figure out first. <laughs> Seriously okay, man? They say men who cheat get cursed. Curse? That's so stupid, I can't even laugh at it. <laughs> the timing's too good. Still, I can't believe you cheated. But if she's that cute a girl, maybe it's a lucky accident, huh? Mm -hmm. Say that. To do. <laughs> well, good luck keeping it a secret. That or beg for her forgiveness. This isn't something forgivable. Well, she's a bit cold. But Catherine's a good girl. You don't have to tell me that. You got a mail. Alright, let's see what Catherine has to say to that. Hey Vincent, let me know if you got this and I'll send you a picture. Come on, you know you want to see it. This is blonde haired Catherine. And I know there's a photo attached to this, but I don't remember how risque first photo is. And I know that there's another photo or two down the line where she's showing a lot more. I want to say that this one's kind of borderline, but I'm not going to open it on stream just yet until I can double check that it's going to, uh... Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? Oh, <laughs> sorry for staring. <laughs> Please sit. Um, have you ever heard this story before? The man who climbs the highest mountain gets his every wish granted. Yes, that? It said a man climbed that mountain 300 years ago and was given a fortune. It said a man climbed that mountain 700 years ago and was given the world. A man who climbs the mountain now will be given his future to do with as he pleases. Is this a fairy tale or something? <laughs> These are true stories. The story of Rapunzel is based on this true story. A prince who was able to climb a very tall tower gained his princess. Now, what will you hmm. gain? Huh? Will you become the man of legends? You guys know way too much for your own good. It's Catherine. Well, let's pick it up because we're not quite that drunk. It's me. What is it, Catherine? Well, Catherine. It's okay. I think I should tell you face to face. Huh? Oh, okay. So, since I've already played, I have an inkling. Mr. Morgan will like that piano. I wonder if that piano will bless Mr. Morgan. You got a mail. About tomorrow, can we do... Er, can we do lunch tomorrow? You don't need an answer right now. Just meet me at the cafe. I'll be there, so please come. Okay, what's up? Sounds important. I'll definitely be there. Go easy on yourself. Good night. We're gonna send that off. We're slowly getting into the... Blue. Um, passages how the time passes when you sit down and talk to people in the bar. Patrons will come and go. While you're sitting at the counter or in a booth, keep that in mind as time passes, the topic of conversation will occasionally change. Don't worry, there are no other actions that can make it progress. Okay. So I will check that pic picture and make sure that it's... Seem a little familiar, no sir. Either. Time 
will slowly pass each time you sit and talk to people. Have fun with the other bar patrons. Over time, the people and the conversation topics will change. Some customers are experiencing difficulties. Try to cheer them up. You can go home at any time from the... Perhaps it wasn't the best idea to hire a musician for her looks. <laughs> it's just that when I saw her, I felt an arrow pierce my heart. That's a miracle you haven't run this place into the ground. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> have you seen the news recently? It's nothing but stories about those deaths. He said that there are several people who died in the same fashion. Erica says that people believe it's a curse given when a woman is scorned by an unfaithful man. A grown man talking about curses? It just ignore Erica. A woman's guess is much more accurate than a man's certainty. To pinch a phrase from a certain someone. You don't think it applies to Erica? Then there's nothing to worry about. Erica's guesses are never on target. By the way, you look a bit glum. Hey boss, you uh, you ever cheated on someone? My, my, my. It's not like that. It was an unintentional event. Unintentional? Are you sure about that? Alright, so now we have to answer if our cheating was intentional or not. Um, and we're gonna say I'm telling the I'm truth. So sure. Besides, I heard you're wearing those shades to hide from an ex-girlfriend. Love is the whole history of a woman's life. It is but an episode in a man's. <laughs> to borrow a line from a certain someone. Yeah. <laughs> a certain someone. It's a strange rumor, and both of us should be careful. Yeah, I know. Employing a pianist, huh? I guess this bar's ranked up. Listen, Archie, you've got to become a better man. I don't know how you're ranking it, but I'm not desperate to climb the social ladder. Men are only acknowledged by their upward mobility. Don't be a tumbleweed. Be like Ivy. Be always like playing. Ivy, always and Let me introduce you. Interesting. This is Todd, and this is Archie. Are you on your way home from the office? Or not? You're not wearing a suit. A suit? Oh, I don't have that kind of job. That's a shame. You're not one of our customers, then. What do you mean? We make business suits. Haven't hmm. you ever heard of Bantam suits? Have you heard the jingle? You'll be the cock of the walk in a Bantam. Oh, you're from Catherine's company. Hey, I think I've heard your voice before. Huh? Have we met? Um... Well, if it's from her work, then maybe they could have met before. But I know that we've met him in the uh, uh, nightmare world. Think of it, but I don't remember anything. Todd's a hard guy to forget. His hair looks like a rooster, doesn't it? That's enough cockadoodlery out of you. Oh, uh, wow, you're sharp. <laughs> you got a mail. I like my women like I like my blankets. Replaced by a maid every morning. What on earth are you talking about? Replaced by a maid every morning. Uh, I think I'll go home for today. My head hurts. Ah. Oh. All right. Let's check the phone real quick. <laughs> All right. Just because I don't want to get banned. to check it now and I can't I don't want to risk it ah uh, I want to play this game but I know that it's like one of the craziest uh, game choices to probably play at least as a live stream I'm trying to think if there's a way that I can get around That way I can I 
Mm, what do I do? Well, we'll talk to Erica for a second. I wonder who the stalker was. Rin doesn't seem worried, but you can never be too careful. Oh shit, it's the fan. You'll protect her, right? It's your problem too? Seriously. Anyway, you a cheater? Who would have thought? Don't you care about Catherine? Uh, of course, but I feel like I wasn't even involved with it. Well, you were. I hate to be so confrontational, but jeez. Men who cheat are cursed. If that rumor's real, what are you gonna do? Nothing, because it's not real. Mm, you say that now. I think Catherine started dating you because she just couldn't leave you alone. You're stupid in all the right ways. It tickles her maternal instincts. A dominant, independent personality like hers is usually attracted to minds like yours. <laughs> is that the way it is? Mm, I can semi confirm that. Okay? Rin's no child, but still, I've never seen someone so innocent. I feel like I need to step up and be Mama Erica. You're not uh. filling me with confidence here. <laughs> Time passes so slowly here. It's really nice. What do you usually do here, Vincent? Uh, oh, um, well... I guess I drink and relax. <laughs> that sounds like fun. I'd love to join you when things aren't so crazy. Oh, uh... <laughs> really is kind of sweet, though. Be careful, Vincent. What do you mean? Um, it's hard to explain, but I have a tingling feeling like something's coming. Oh, are you sick? You should probably get some rest. <laughs> of course. You have a weird sense for this stuff, don't you? Alright, I gotta go take a so look. Orlando's divorced. Huh? You didn't know? He got married while he was pretty young. He lost a lot of money in some scam. His wife left him. He pretends not to mind, but I... Even when his wife calls him, he... Huh? Hmm. What do you mean? Um, well, never mind. We'll, we'll talk about it later. Wow. Is it that late on... Is that the time? I should be heading home soon. Uh, it's late. Anyway, I can't hurt her anymore. Yo, Vincent, we're leaving now. You're not going on? Uh, well, I think I'll stay. All right, so I think now we have the option. Ah, <sighs> when you drink, you can raise your intoxication level up to three times. How drunk Vincent gets corresponds to how fast he moves that night in his nightmare. How long are you going to avoid the inevitable? <laughs> You'll have to pay for your sins. Did, did I just hear something? Yep. You're in <laughs> Yay, you're here! That voice. We're gonna check the phone again real quick. Make sure we haven't missed anything um, outside of her picture. Ah. Oh, shit. I've never cheated in my life before. Why are you here? I thought you'd be here around this time. Just like last night. Uh, not yesterday. I don't really remember that much. And actually, I... Oh, hey! Do you want me to wake up early tomorrow and make you breakfast? What do you want to eat? I'm a pretty good cook. No! Huh? Why not? N not today, I mean. More than today. Just... I, I can't. <laughs> You're cute. <laughs> I'm... going to the restroom. One stream that was a better no, play and now no, no longer... No more cheating. Okay! Fuck! Ah! 
Why are you... You were taking forever, uh, and I got worried. Oh, well, I'll see you... Huh? Uh... You can't leave me now! We finally have a moment to ourselves! Oh! 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 no! I'm all wet! <laughs> like it? Uh... I'll go get a towel. <laughs> Better to have loved and lost than to, than to have loved at all. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Take a oh, cheating, huh? It's not like I can just apologize for it and everything will be fine. No, you have to win her hey, cup back. Can't I come over? It's just bad. If someone saw us like this, I. Why are you acting all embarrassed? You want to leave right now, then? J just no. All right. All right. So, thinking we should save here, and we shall continue with night three. On the next stream. So. I apologize that I wasn't very talkative tonight, uh, or today on this particular stream. Um, it's kind of hard when the game itself has its own kind of dialogue and things going on, and I do want to pay attention to some of the story myself, especially since they've tossed in a new character, a new storyline to kind of follow. Um, so it's definitely going to, um, uh, make me want to pay a little more attention so when we start tomorrow or the next nightmare which i believe begins once we walk out those doors it will um be affected by the fact that we've got two of the three drinks um that we drank and i believe there's an option to get different drinks um i think those unlock in the next night um and i don't know if any of those have any effect on us on the uh, gameplay either so yeah so hopefully you guys enjoyed hopefully maybe uh watching me struggle a few times to get up that first little section or the second section will help you guys maybe Give, get a crack at um, the best way to move up the stairs. I definitely want to give the hard levels a try, but I don't want to play through the game on the hardest levels. So maybe we'll have a day or two or a, uh, a stream or two where we try and go back and redo some levels as um, in hard mode. But yeah, that's all the time that I have right now. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a great night.